Welcome to 5K Saturday. Um, it is the Ellie Big 5K this morning, and I'm really excited. Uh, we just got here to the parking. There's a ton of people here already, but we just have enough time to warm up, get ready, and uh, really just kind of get settled into our 5K mode. So let's get on going because uh, today is going to be a bit chill in terms of my running pace because I'm gonna take it easy. Today is a shakeout run for the LA Marathon, which is tomorrow, and um, can't wait. A little bit of a breeze this morning. Whew, chilly. Right now it's about 52 degrees out this morning. It's 734. Whew. But the sun is coming out.
there's a lot of walkers, so I'm trying to find an open spot to uh, slip through. So far, it's going okay. This one over to third hill. Final hill up, heading back into the stadium. And uh, pretty close to the finish line at this point. <laughs> And that completes the 2024 LA Big 5K. Now, as I mentioned before, this wasn't really much of a race for me today, but more of a shakeout run in preparation for the LA Marathon, which was the next day. I will say though, we had some really great weather. I think it was somewhere along in the 60s, 60 degrees Fahrenheit and above. So it was really great. And uh, the energy was pretty awesome. There was a bit of traffic trying to get into the stadium, but you know what? Made it in time, still had time to spare for a warm up and just get into my spot in the corral. And of course, this signifies the end of training really for the LA Marathon and I couldn't be any happier. Now I just got my official results. So let's take a look here. I finished at 40 minutes and one second with a pace of 12 minutes and 53 seconds. So it's not too bad. And I finished overall my age group uh, pretty much in the middle of the pack of the total. So it's not too bad. And overall as well as in, in the middle. So it was pretty much on par with what I thought it was gonna be. And I did take it easy um, for this run. I didn't push myself too hard because I wanted to preserve as much energy for the marathon. And of course, I am wearing my finisher shirt here which I will probably wear for the marathon, you know, add some color instead of all the black I've been wearing. And of course, the one thing you guys have all came here to see is the bling. So this is the finisher medal that we received at the end of it. 
And if you've been following along, this was actually part of a Triple K challenge that I had been doing. So the first one was at the Santa Monica Classic last September, and then the Rose Bowl 5K this past January. And now that I finished the LA Big 5K, I got this pretty sweet finisher medal for finishing all three. And the cool thing is, it spins. <laughs> and with that, we'll leave it here. I'm gonna leave you all in suspense one more time because I know what you're all are waiting for. So do come back next week because I have a full LA Marathon race video for you so you do not want to miss out. Now, if you're new to the channel and enjoy the adventures that we have here or feel inspired for your own running journey, why not subscribe and like the video as it does help and hopefully reach others as well to be inspired for their own journey. And of course, we do have more adventures coming up, so you don't want to miss out on any of it. I hope you're all doing well. Let me know in the comments. Until then, I'll see you all next time. Take care.